General Hospital's father teased that Jason Morgan lost his memory and saw the entire mob as enemy. Jason may have been a mysterious attacker all along, but Jason's first attack was the one at Metro Court Pool. That meant Jason had been in town a long time ago, and all this time Jason had to remember whether he was Jason Morgan or Jason Cartman. Jason thinks he is strong and is doing the right thing to wipe out all the mob in town. Jason's was probably having memories from before the accident many years ago that caused Jason to act strangely and no longer remember anything related to Sonny Corrento or Colleen Spencer. Many predictions say that under the name Stone, Jason committed many crimes and most recently murdered Oliva Jerome. Meaning, Jason could also be the person who paralyzed Curtis Asford, and also the person who killed Austin Gatlin Holt. Jason may be brainwashed when we have mentioned this in previous videos, but who brainwashed Jason and turned him into stone is still a secret. Returning to Sonny's patience, Sonny suspects there is a traitor in the organization. Of course, Jax Howler is then exposed and chased out of town, but in reality, in addition to Jax, Sunny organization still has at least one of the traitors. We still have reason to suspect Rick, but Sunny currently has no evidence to prove it. But sooner or later, Sunny will know the truth. That's right, when Sunny and Diamond's finale have set a trap. Jason was the one who fell into the trap and was seriously injured. Of course, the mysterious attacker was identified by Sunny. As Jason, after Sonny saw a familiar figure, that's why Sonny then did not pursue Jason. Instead, Sonny would wonder why Jason was a traitor. Sonny secretly investigated and learned that Jason was hiding at Elizabeth Weber's house. But what surprised Sonny was that Brick was also snooping around Lee's house. Sonny will sneak behind Brick when Brick makes a call, hearing what Brick calls person on the other end of the light stall. Brick asks Stone about his injury and if Stone could continue on the mission. By then, Sonny had a reason to attack Brick. Of course, Sonny will also know that the person named Stone is Jason and that Brick was pulling a string for Jason's action. Sonny is hurt when both of his former henchmen are traitors. Sonny is angry when everyone has turned their back on Sonny. Of course, Sonny will also detain and torture Brick. Sonny wants to know the exact reason why Jason changed his name and betrayed Sonny. During this process, Jason will not know that his secret boss has been captured. Jason will still hide at Lee's house and continue to treat his world. Of course, Jason will eventually be taken away by some of Sonny's secret henchmen. When confronted by Sonny, Jason shows hatred and wants to attack Sonny. Jason did not recognize Sonny. And Sonny later told Collie Spencer about Jason condition. Kali rushed to the warehouse and had to accept losing Jason again. Of course, because Jason didn't remember who Kali was. In Jason's mind, there was only one goal to take down everyone who belonged to the mob, even Kali included. Sunny decided to continue imprisoning. Rick and Jason is that secret place until Sonny found a solution and better understood the problem Jason was facing.